We're going to examine the passing technique of Corey Moster, All-American Libro from Michigan State University. After attending a recent practice session with Michigan State, I was impressed with just the mechanics of Corey's passing, and I thought it would be worthwhile to, to examine a little bit. What you're going to see is the way great passers contact the ball, and that is they're very calm with their upper body, and all the work is done with their feet and their legs. So what I've done is I tried to identify the angle of the spine, and you can see as she starts – and where she finishes, in actuality, the line moves very little, but everything is done with her lower body. So there's no bending over at the waist. It's everything is hip angle. She drops her hip. She bends her knees. She bends her ankles. Very little bending of the back. Yet now I've put a line up, and you'll notice how Corey works under the line with her head. She moves in a low posture, and sometimes she'll raise up as she's passing and directing the ball to her target but generally she moves very low. Here's another way of demonstrating how everything's done with her hips and not her back as she bends over. So a, a wonderful demonstration of just moving in a low posture, keeping the head level, and everything's done with the legs, the knees, and the ankles. Very little is done with the upper body. And I think that's a key ingredient of every good passer is their upper body is very calm. There's not a lot of up and down movement with the head. The head stays level as they move. Everything is done with the lower body and the hips. And so, so you can see, as she contacts the ball, her upper body is moving very, very little, but her legs are driving the ball to the target. And she's definitely driving it to the target. So as she as the ball meets her forearms, she's pushing forward. So a wonderful exhibition of serve received by Corey Moster at Michigan State.